Hello everyone. Welcome back to the nursery. My name's Vicki. Uh, guys, today I'm going to be changing little Stanley Oliver. Guys, I've had him in this little outfit for so long, but it is so sweet on him. I just, I honestly, I get these outfits like this. Look at this. Isn't that pretty? On them, and I do not want to change them for nothing. They're so, they're so beautiful. But it's time. The little guy's got to have something new on. Let's take off. had his little mittens. Everything was matching on this outfit on him. And I, I hate to take it off so much. But we got to give him a change, guys. It's time. Um, I'm going to be putting him today in this little Fisher Price outfit I got. Now, it may be a little big on him, but if it is, I don't mind. It's okay. It's just like this. It's a it's a blue, but it's kind of a mm, maybe an aqua type blue or something. This is brand new. I found this at a yard sale for a dollar. So uh, it says life is too short to take a nap, and it's got Z's and a little lamb on it. I thought it's just like a little um, uh, t-shirt type thing with a little pair of a diaper cover. Yeah, that's what it's called. Uh, so I'm going to take this off of him. I hate to. It's so sweet on him. But it's time to get him changed, I think. And uh, I even have the little, see this? Little matching socks. Everything was matching on it on him. I'll put it on him again one day. Though. And, uh, or on maybe baby Henry. Let him wear it one day. He hasn't got to wear this. So I might put it on him. Come on, little baby. This is my little Stanley Oliver. And uh, this is a, um, a baby that was uh, sculpted to resemble a little Down Syndrome baby, guys. It's, he's so beautiful. Look at the smile on his face. Isn't he gorgeous? I think he's so precious. So, as I said, I'm going to be putting him on this little diaper cover. Now, this may be too big on him. It actually looks like it's going to be. You know, he's not real big. He's not a preemie, but he's not a big baby either. He's, he's kind of like a small to me zero to three months and a small one but who knows it might fit him pretty good i just love the to me this little diaper cover on this is what i thought was so cute it's just a little simple just a little pullover diaper cover and to me it's just so cute too it's it's hot here today so i thought well i'm gonna put him on something cooler and maybe it won't be too big on him i don't know uh we'll see but to me he's more like a uh like a smaller zero to three. Not exactly a preemie, though. Come on, baby. Let's get this on you. Ah, look at him. Yay, he looks so sweet. And since it's hot and this is just like a little summery outfit, I am going to leave. Um, let me turn this up a little. I'm going to leave his um, socks off. I'm just going to leave him barefoot. This is like a real cool, little comfortable little outfit. The shirt's just a little bit big, but not too much bad. See? Look at him. Isn't he a sweetie? He's so happy. He says, oh, I'm so happy. Look at that. The sweet little face. Isn't he gorgeous? He's got beautiful blue eyes. Isn't he pretty? There you go, little man. There you go, sweet angel. Put him back on his little bracelet. That's his little bracelet that says baby. And yeah, so there's little Stanley. Oh, yeah. He's such a sweet little baby. Oh, I like doing this. It makes him look like he's sucking his thumb. He's so precious, guys. He's a beautiful kit. If you haven't seen him, uh, you know, anybody, I, you wouldn't be sorry to get him. Really, you wouldn't. Because he's he's very beautiful. Uh, I'm going to give him a little wipe off the head and stuff, guys. Now, this is just a, a washcloth, guys. It's just damp. Just water and just damp. Yes, and we're going to clean him up. Yes, we are. We're going to clean that beautiful up. I'm going to wipe out his eyes just a little bit. You know, stuff gets dusty. Put some on your tongue, buddy. Uh, guys, if you're doing their, like, the, I should have brought some in with me, but I didn't. If you're doing, like, their mouth or their ears or stuff, you can do, uh, sorry about that, guys. It's not showing too good. You can do, like, a Q-tip, and it helps a whole lot, like, in the ears and stuff. I didn't bring one in with me, but I just wanted to dust him off a little bit because he hasn't been 
cleaned up my good little while and, and once in a while I'll just dust them all off a little bit with a damp cloth um I got a new series coming up guys I want I want everybody to see I'm not going to give it away I'm hoping to have it on my next video uh it's something that I found yesterday evening and I'm going to bring it on. I'll let you guys see it. And I'm going to, I want to do a documentation of it. So I'm going to have several videos on that. And I'll let you guys in on it. Maybe tomorrow I'll be able to do the video. But soon, soon, if not tomorrow, very soon. And uh, yeah, I want everybody to see. Get his little eyelashes back up the way they're supposed to be. I wet them. Here we go, sweet boy. And there he is. I just wiped him down just a little bit. And he says, hello, everybody. He's so sweet. Bless it. Bless its little heart. It's such a sweetie pie. There you go, sweet boy. He's precious, guys. He's a precious baby. Guys, I wanted to show you one more thing before I get off here. I know this is a quick video, but I want to show you one more thing. I have a new completed dress that I made, crocheted, and I want you guys to see it. I did it all in white. Let me bring it up. The collar I done, it's going to kind of stand up. Let me get it up there so you can see. And then I bought this beautiful button at Walmart. And I put that on there. It's kind of like a button, I guess, what you call it. It's, it's made out of like soft stuff material. And I got that done. And I put that on there and I got the little sleeve. Sorry about that guys, my dogs are bar barking. Somebody must be here. And this is the bottom of it. It's kind of done like in a bean stitch. And then I done the tail the same way. And I put it a beautiful pearl button, give it a pretty, real pretty pearl button. Sorry about that. And what I done guys was I took just like a little of elastic and I slowed it there to where it coming like, you know, go over the top of that. I can use eye hook and closure, but guys, I didn't want to put that on these dresses. You know, to me, it's they're just too fancy and beautiful to be putting eye hook and closure on the back. But anyway, and then I put a beautiful, it's white with kind of a little iridescent, silvery-like tone to it, a uh, ribbon around it. Anyway, let me get up there so close. It's kind of like the bean stitch. Guys, I want to tell you on this yarn, I love this yarn. It's beautiful. It's got a great, great, a beautiful drape to it. I mean, it's just like, you know, it's just really, it's not stiff or nothing. Like some of the acrylics are. This I done in, it's called Kobu. Uh, line, it's line brand yarn. Kobu. C-O-B-O-O. -O. It is, there's a cotton and then there's rayon uh, from bamboo in it. It has, it's wonderful yarn. I mean, the feel of it is so soft. It, it would, any baby could wear this. I mean, a real baby could wear it. It's so soft. It's not itchy one bit. And it's so soft and it's so beautiful. And the, the, the rayon from the bamboo gives it almost a little bit of a shine. Like a sheen. But, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. This is beautiful. And I will continue to buy the, uh, uh, Kobu because... I love the way it feels and stuff, and I love the way it looks. It's like real drapey, see? But this stuff, you talking about a pain in your rear to work with. My goodness. Uh, splitting. Awful, 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 awful to split. Uh, if you don't want a lot of aggravation, do not buy the Kobu yarn. I will continue to buy it because I love it. I love the feel of it. I love the look of it. I love the drape of it. If you love it as, you know, enough to deal with it, then that's great. But if you're not wanting aggravation, don't get this yarn. Um, I will continue to buy it, though, because I just love the yarn. I, I'm willing to put up with the aggravation of it to get the look. Uh, but, yes, it is very aggravating yarn. It, I mean, it just splits horribly bad. Horribly bad, guys. And uh, here's the back. But it turned out to be a beautiful uh, item. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. But you talk about splitting and stuff. Oh, wow. And uh, It almost ran me crazy. Now, I'm trying to do a pink one in this, too. Just out of the same yarn. 
uh, only it'll be pink or a pale pink. It's very pretty. But see the collar? It's done just like the bottom is. It'll stand up. I thought that was so pretty for the collar on it. But yeah, there is my little newest crocheted baby dress. And I think it turned out real great. And yeah, I'll be putting it on one of my babies. I am going to, as usual, I'm going to try to make a diaper cover to go with it as soon as I can. And get the time, guys. And I want some booties and a bonnet out of the same yarn and matching, you know, in the white yarn, just solid white. So I thought I would do this in a solid white. I, I sometimes like solid white uh, items, garments, um, sometimes on the babies especially, like little solid white dresses. I like that. It shows off their skin tone, and the color, you know, of them and stuff, and I really like that. But I love this little button I got up at Walmart. You see? Very pretty. Very pretty little thing. And, uh, yeah. So, there it is. And I'll try to get to a uh, little diaper cover and stuff like that made to go with it. But, anyway, I thought I would show you my newest little dress, guys, that I crocheted. And uh, I've got three now made. Very pretty little dresses for the babies. And, uh, yeah, I'll continue to make them. I'm getting better and better at crocheting them. They're looking more, more and more and more professional as I go. Uh, they're all made different. They're not one of them. I've made three, but no, none of them are alike. This one is done more in a bean stitch, what they call a bean stitch. The other one is like a granny stitch. And then I don't know what this other one is. Uh, this was the blue with the white. It turned out beautiful because of the color. The white just made that dress pop. But it's got, it's the holes in it are quite big. And this one turned out bigger, guys. And I don't have a baby right now that that fits. This is a bigger dress. It turned out a little bigger than the other ones. You can see there's quite a bit, there's quite a bit of difference in this one and that one. And this one turned out bigger. And I just don't have a baby that size that can wear it. So I don't know. I may be, I might see into like gifting this to somebody as a gift. It's very beautiful. It's It's got the shell uh, edging on it. It's real pretty. Turned out beautiful. I do have an eye hook enclosure on that, but I'm going to change that out. Put a, I got several of these little pearl buttons. I'm going to put a pretty pearl button on it. That was that one. I don't know what that stitch is called. But this is the other one, the yellow one. And uh, this was the yellow with the white. It turned out nice, too. And then I made it a little, if you remember... A little diaper cover to match. I haven't got the diaper cover for the other ones yet. But that one turned out pretty too. That's that one. And then I have made this white one. And I just love the drape on this one. It's just not stiff at all. See? Now, guys, uh, this will be a delicate one right here. This little dress. Because I told you this thread... Split so bad. I wouldn't dare wash this in the washer. There's no way I would hand wash this and lay it flat to dry Even though the instructions on the yarn may say something different. I wouldn't do it. This will be very very delicate You know, so if when I wash it, it will be hand washed. I wouldn't dare put it in the washer No way. It's just too delicate. It would I would be too afraid. It would ruin it So anyway, that's it guys. I just thought I would let you see all that and let you see my baby. And this is his little outfit. I got him at the yard sale the other day. And I think it's so cute on him. And it's very summery and cool. Uh, guys, as I said, I've got a new series I'm going to come up with. And I'm hoping to get it done with the next day or two. You'll be watching for it. it everybody's going to have a big surprise. Um, yeah. And uh, it's going to be fun. It's a fun surprise. And it's, it's a big surprise. And uh, yeah. I got a new baby coming to the nursery. But, guys, it's a mystery. It's not what you think. Okay, guys, that's it. I will talk to you soon in a new video. Keep your eye out for the, the uh, mystery baby. And tell everybody, bye-bye, Stanley. He says, bye-bye, everybody. Okay, guys, I will talk to you soon in a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Much love to y'all, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.